Dancing on Ice's Greg Rutherford has shared a video of the exact dance move that led to his horrifying injury. After he was rushed to hospital just hours before showtime and forced to miss out on the ITV final, Dancing on Ice star Greg Rutherford has revealed for the first time exactly how diving between two co stars' legs led to him being rushed to AE for stitches, ahead of his partner Susie weighing in on the freak accident, too. The former Olympian published a rehearsal video on Instagram of himself gliding gracefully over the ice to the tune of a classic New York theme song, Before Disaster Struck. The 37 year old, who'd been dressed as a sailor, told his 194,000 followers, Here we go. This is the showcase we didn't get to perform due to injury. The point where I dive through Colin, Grafton, and Brendan, Hatfield's legs is where everything went wrong last Sunday. He explained. This is from either Friday or Saturday so I was still ironing out a few timings issues which I'm sure you will notice. However, in spite of the trauma that was to come, Greg remained buoyant when recalling his memories of the ill-fated rehearsal session. I utterly loved this showcase. Everyone involved had worked so hard, he marveled. Just look at the set too. The guys behind the scenes never get enough credit. What they build in such a short amount of time is mind-blowing. Referring to the iconic duo who are sadly due to hang up their skates forever in 2025, Greg gushed to have a turbulent Dean official choreograph a full routine for his two was so special. I loved working with them. He went on to set fans' minds at rest by bowing head return to the rink. Although I won't be able to skate for maybe a couple of months, I intend on getting back on the ice and keeping it up. I really do love it, he promised. Some confused fans demanded to know the exact details of what had happened, with one musing. He was going to say all the details the day after he got out of the hospital but never did. However, the comments received a knockback from fellow followers, with one exclaiming in Greg's defense. People seem to think we all have the rights to a person's medical records. He didn't sign a contract to tell everyone on the internet the ins and outs of his injury, another agreed.